Everybody loves a cool trick. No matter how well we know an app or program, there's almost always some shortcut we never learned. Hey everyone, it's Manny, the DIY guy with Team Commando. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment on the video. In this Commando DIY, we've got helpful tips, tricks, and shortcuts for popular tech, programs, and tools. You ready? Let's do this. Number one, put your USB drive in the right way the first time. Plugging in a USB cable the right way feels like a no-brainer. Then why do we get it wrong on the first try so often? Here's the secret. Grab any USB cable sitting around your house. See that symbol on one side? It's not just branding or decoration. That symbol will point up if you're plugging in horizontally. And if you're plugging a cable vertically, the USB symbol will face you. Pretty cool, right? Number two, reopen a closed browser tab. How many browser tabs do you have open? Come on, be honest. It's annoying when you accidentally close the wrong one. You can open up your browser's history and reopen the tab from there, or you can do it with a couple of keystrokes. Hit Control Shift T on your PC or Command Shift T on your Mac to automatically reopen the tab you just closed. Number three, share a YouTube video at a precise point. If you see something in a YouTube video that you want to share at a particular point, Get a link that takes people directly to that moment. Click the share button below the video. Look for a checkbox below the link. It will automatically display the time at which you currently have the video stopped. Copy the link and share it with whoever you like. When someone views the link, the YouTube video will automatically skip right to the point you choose. Number four, use your voice in Google Docs. You probably already use your phone's speech to text to dictate text messages or even emails but did you know you can do the same in Google Docs? It's free and it works surprisingly well. Open a new document in Google Docs, then enable voice typing from the tools menu. Then start dictating. Voice typing recognizes commands like comma, period, and new paragraph as well. Number five, unsend an email. Did you just send out an email to everyone that was meant for one person? Yikes. Well, Gmail has the ability to unsend an email by adjusting one setting prior to writing your email. Open up your settings in Gmail, then select Settings. In the Undo Send section, the default will be set to 5 seconds. Select the range and choose an option. We recommend 30 seconds to really buy you some time. Then scroll down and click Save Changes for it to take effect. There you have it! Try these tricks and let us know what you think in the comments below. Hey, thanks for watching. Now a few things. Don't forget to click the like button and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. And for more digital know-how, check out all these other great links.